Daisy. Daisy, come on, darling. Come on, come on outside with me. Come on. Fear not, everyone. The registrar doesn't need to be anywhere, so there's no rush. Look, we're just trying to find out where the bride is, so in the meantime, if any of you need to go to the bathroom or top yourself up at the bar, feel free. Oh, yeah, babe, you fixed it. Daisy? Yeah? Yeah, how, how did you know? Daisy. The nurse called your name out. Daisy Midgley. Daisy Midgley. That's right. I'm here with my Daisy. Mom. She's got cancer. Hey, you all right? Yeah. Thank you. Daisy. 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 It wasn't supposed to be him. Daisy. Look, I'm so sorry, Daisy, but you may have valuable information Look, that could sorry. help us. Yeah. Is there any chance you can come back later? I mean, look at her. She's hardly in a fit state. Yeah, I know. Yeah, she needs to go to hospital herself. It may help us catch him. Right. Can, can you just go easy on her? Are you absolutely sure it was just in who threw the substance? I'd take that as a yes if I were you. Yeah, I know, but I need her to tell me that. Uh, uh, how many times she's told you who it was? Did he say anything before he left? He gave no indication as to where he was heading to. Oh, for crying out loud, you know why don't you just stop wasting time here and get out there and look for him? There are plenty of officers searching for him right now. Plenty. How many is plenty? Five. A hundred. I'm sorry, Daisy, but... 500. I mean, when you say plenty, how many are actually out there looking for him? I don't have an exact number. No. I didn't think so. You don't know anything. Please, Daisy. And when you do, you do nothing about it. I have reported him so many times i have called your lot i've been to the station i've made statements i am so sorry i told you i told you he was dangerous and nothing happened you did nothing doesn't matter how many times i told you all i got was he hasn't done anything he hasn't done anything he hasn't done anything well he has now hasn't he you knew Everything about him. Everything. And he was still free to do. To do this. We'll catch him. I promise you. Why don't you go tell that to Ryan? I'm sure that'll make everything all right.
the specialist in with him now. Apparently, they're giving him more fee. It wasn't meant for him. It was for me. It's my fault. This is all my fault. No. I pushed Justin to this. I called the police on you him. You did the right no. thing. No. I got him arrested. I moved this to the next level. I pushed him. No, no. I should have handled it differently. I should have. What? <laughs> what should you have done? Jane. No, no, no. Come on. What could you have done differently, eh? What could you have done that would have stopped him? Given in to him? Told him he was right? What, that by stalking you day and night, what, he'd somehow proved himself worthy of you and won your love? No. There was nothing you could have done. Nothing at all. Justin is responsible for this. Not you. See Ryan. Where is he? Anna, come and sit down. Excuse me. Excuse me. Are you looking after Ryan Connor? I have to see him. We're doing our best for him. Is he still in pain? We're controlling it. But is he going to be okay? We've managed to normalise the surface pH level of most of the affected skin, but there are a few areas that we're struggling with. I, I don't know what that means. Do you know what that means? I'm sorry. I need to get back. I have to see him. Please. Just give me a minute. something like this. I mean, throw acid at Ryan. Why? It wasn't meant for him. It was meant for me. But it, 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 it's the man who's been stalking her. He always shows up. No matter where she goes, what she does, he always shows up. <laughs> 